Alright, hey guys, here's your prepper here. I wanted to do a uh, video for you guys. I just wanted to, first off, um, wish all my subs and all my friends and all the people I'm subscribed to uh, a very merry Christmas and to have a safe and happy new year. Um, I enjoy the YouTube community greatly. I've made quite a bit of friends have learned a lot of new stuff and prepping and I'm glad I've come up on you know the YouTube community and I w kinda wish I could go back in time and you know find it out sooner but I found it out when I did so it, you know it's good enough for me um, but just wanted to wish you guys that and I want to show you uh, this is going to be part one of a uh, DIY video uh, I'm going to be doing um, deep frying two turkeys for Christmas this year. I'm going to be having family up. I'm going to have my family come in for Christmas, and then my wife's family is going to be coming in for Christmas. And we got two 20 pound turkeys that we're going to deep fry. So, figure I'd uh, bring you guys along with me and show you what I'm going to be doing. And it'll probably be two parts, no more than three. I think it's just going to be two. But, um, show you what I'm going to be doing. Um, we got a 20 pound turkey in front of you. We got it from Myers. We got it back before Thanksgiving for 68 cents a pound. Um, what we're going to be doing is a Cajun style turkey. Um, I inject it with the Creole butter, if that's how you pronounce it. Um, got this uh, set at Myers. Comes in a set like that. Uh, for about uh, three or four bucks, comes with its own injector. I got two extra ones because I bought that, and they have it. They usually have it in the jars. This is what I got with my deep fryer that I just use. Um, but use that the Creole butter, inject it into the turkey, each turkey, and then pour it over the turkey itself. And then I use an occasion. Louisiana Cajun seasoning. It's pretty good. We I had it before uh, through one of my old jobs, and uh, we uh, they deep fried it for uh, Christmas dinner for us, and I enjoyed it. So I wanted to make it for my family, and we did it last year. And they really enjoyed it. So, um, hope you guys enjoy this uh, little video. I'll try to set it up a little bit so you guys can see what I'm doing. Um, uh, if you can't see what's going on, I apologize. I'll try to grab the uh, phone up a couple times to show you what I'm going to do. First off, i got to take it out of the package and uh, rinse it out and dab it with paper and make sure it's, you know, all dry and not having no water. So, I'll put it down for now and hopefully you guys can see it. Alrighty, hopefully. Apologies. Apologize if you can't. <clears throat> so, but just gotta cut off the netting of it. And yes, I don't use any instructions with this. It's pretty self-explanatory. You inject the turkey with the Creole butter. You use the injector and. Place into the meat, and they you got to do. You know, the less hole punctures, the better because it'll keep the butter itself inside the turkey, and it won't go into your deep fryer. And it won't cause any explosions. So, all right. So, sorry if I don't talk much. Just trying to get this taken care of. But the reason why I wanted to do this little video is I figured it'd be a nice DIY video for you know preppers. Um, but a lot of a lot of people, um, you know, don't like uh, doing these turkey, you know, deep frying turkeys because they're afraid, uh, you know, catching on fire or blowing themselves up. And what a lot of people do is. 
they, uh, you know, don't, they thaw it all, you know, they, some people think this by, uh, you know, uh, putting it in a deep fryer, frozen, they won't have to worry about it, that they think that hot oils will take care, you know, take care of it and thaw it themselves, well, that's basically stupid, because you're putting something that's solid cold into, into 300 to 400 degree heat, and, you know, that's basically, it's dropping a, dropping in a bomb, um, so, yeah, um, and they also, uh, um, go Billy, get out of here, get out of here, um, get, you can't touch this, um, also, when they go to rinse it out, they have, uh, um, you know, they leave water in there, and that's basically, again, dropping water in something hot. And that's just, again, cause, cause the fires. So, I figured I'd just do it, show you the. Show so anybody who wants to learn it the right way. And I did it last year. It was my first year doing it, and I was successful. I didn't blow myself up, didn't catch anything on fire. So I figured it'd be a good little video to show everybody if they wanted to learn how to do it. I think this is actually going to be two parts because I'm going to stop it here. So the video don't get too long, and the next video would be uh, showing the uh, injecting the turkey itself. So let me uh, clean my hands up, and uh, we'll continue on. As you can see, starting to clean it out, and I'll be right back.